c'est la première fois que le Mona Bismarck American Center organise une exposition majeure de l'art contemporain fait spécialement pour le lieu et pour fêter notre 30e anniversaire. C'était important d'exposer les nouvelles voies artistiques. Shamim Momin, la commissaire invitée, quand elle a proposé d'avoir une exposition dans deux lieux très différents, le nôtre et la galerie Thaddeus Robac à Pantin, cette proposition nous a évidemment beaucoup intéressé d'avoir cette conversation entre les deux espaces et avec les contemporains dans un lieu historique. The theme of the title, Wasteland. Now that's a reference to the great modernist poem um, by T.S. Eliot, The Wasteland, which was written in 1923, but at a time I think that has a lot of similarities to the world right now, both on the scale of politics, on the scale of interpersonal relationships, on the scale of the city and community. A lot of the same issues and concerns that were being brought out in this great poem, um, I feel that the artists were kind of addressing in their work in a lot of different ways. So to be able to gather the 14 artists uh, under that thematic allowed it to have a bit of its own story or its own narrative at the end of the day. The term wasteland connotes a number of other things as well, uh, one of them being a little bit tongue-in-cheek uh, reference to Los Angeles as a kind of cultural wasteland, which of course isn't indeed true, but it is something that had interpretation that was around for quite a while. So that thematic has multiple different layers, and we've invited all of the artists to create new work responding um, to, to the poem, to the concept, to the sites. There's a lot of opportunity of different ways to layer their conceit of the work or the, how they came up with the ideas. Cette exposition permettra de découvrir la réalité et le dynamisme de l'art de Los Angeles d'aujourd'hui.